back with our pet nature box to share with you guys. Now this is September's box and this is the double trouble box. Now it feels quite light um, and I've already kind of opened it just to kind of save a bit of time. So this is what it looks like inside. As you can see it is really nicely wrapped with some tissue paper and a nice wee piece of string and it also has the information leaflet and a couple of kind of flyers on there as well. So we're excited to dig into this box. I got this box on Friday, today is now Monday. The reason why i never done this on Friday is because Roxy has been quite unwell. She's had quite a runny tummy and I've not wanted to basically introduce any kind of treats that we don't know um, basically when she's not well. So we thought we would give her the weekend to recover and she did. But unluckily yesterday she kind of went back the way so she's now again, well yesterday she basically spent the day having a runny tummy and she was on chicken again. She just loves chicken, I think she's at it. She's just wanting chicken. Sure yeah Roxy. Mm -hmm. So I got her on chicken just now, she's still on light meals so what I will say is, and I have to do this video today because I'm just so excited to see what's in the box. And the dogs are excited as well, plus I'm working the rest of the week and I'm feeling heaps better from when I wasn't well. So I thought I would get this video done today. So unfortunately I'm going to say that Roxy is not going to be trying any of the treats today. Just because I'm working tomorrow and I really don't want her to have an upset stomach when I'm not here. So Pixie is going to be our tester for the uh, Pet Nature's Box treats today. But I do have a bag cut for Roxy so she doesn't feel left out. I have my bag of cooked chicken, so she can have a bit of cooked chicken when I give Pixie one of the treats just because I don't want you feeling left out. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's dig into this box. I'm not going to go into the whole about pet nature because I've done that on my last video, so I'll leave that link to that video down below in the description box. Um, so let's crack on and see... So I always love the way this is packaged. The only thing I'll say about Pet Nature um, since the last video that I've done is that they've changed some of their um, instructions on their subscriptions. So they've added things like no venison, no beef, um, no fish, no lamb, which is really, really good. They've also included the, you know, about your dog. So like your pet's names, um, the date of births, that kind of thing and what breed that your dogs are which I find really really good so we filled all that in um, there was another option no pork now my dogs haven't really had pork before so I did go back in a couple of days before this box was shipped and tick it but that option wasn't really available for me then so I sent them a Facebook message they were they were really really quick at responding which was really good and they took that into consideration and they put the options that I had um, clicked on into my order so because this box had a couple of pork based treats in it they've took them out and they've replaced it which I find really really good as well so they do cater to everybody's needs which is really good and you're sitting there patiently, aren't you? Okay, so our box was lovingly packed by Gemma. Thank you, Gemma, for packing our box. We also have an Emma Please 10% off and a 15% off voucher for the Dog's Glad Rags, which looks like it's kind of bandanas for your dog. Yes, it is. So we'll have a wee look into them later. But let's dig into our box. Okay. Mm. Oh, wow. Look at all that. Wow. Oh, Roxy, I'm sorry. You can't have any. Okay, so this is how the box has came. Full of little goodies. Now this is a double trouble box, so you do get kind of double the items from like the normal box, the Quartastic one. And what I will say is that I have now downgraded my double trouble box to the Potastic box just because 
I said to my partner we would give it another month to see what the double trouble box was like. The double trouble box is amazing, absolutely love it, but for my two small dogs we don't go through all the treats. I think for the Potastic box it would be more suitable for my two to have. Just because they're small dogs, they don't get a lot of treats and they'll probably go through the one bag. I've still got bags of treats from last Pet Nature boxes um, subscriptions, so from last month. So it's trying to get through everything. I think if you had a bigger dog, like if you had two big dogs, then this box would be like, you would use all the treats in this box. But because I have two small dogs, we don't really go through a lot of the treats. So I decided to downgrade to the Potastic box. Um, so that we can get like one of everything and um, just try it really so we're expecting that on next month so this is the last double trouble box we'll be getting but let's dig in and go ahead okay so the first thing we have is paw and sore bam a little something for your pups little knocks, knocks and scrapes another top notch natural organic or like organic product from our friends at pointy faces Made to soothe rough paws and any minor skin complaints. One to keep in the essentials bag. Hmm. And the price of this is usually £9.95. And this is pot and soap balm, organic neem and lavender. Oh, lovely. You want to smell first? Hmm, it's not to eat though. Wow. I can smell the lavender in that. That smells really, really nice. And the is not so sure. We're going to try a bit. Oh, look at that. Let me see your paw. Give me your paw. Give me your paw. Good girl. You rub a wee bit on. Rub, 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 rub. Yeah. Is it nice and soothing? That's quite soft. I like how it's organic. So that's the tub there. And again, I'm sorry if this isn't focusing. I'm still trying to sort out my camera. Okay, now the next thing we have is the Serrano Fish Snacks times two. And these come in at £1.49. And these are fish. So... A little taste of Spain to tie in with the lovely hot weather we've been having. Tasty snacks, perfect for a day at the beach that are also gluten free. So these are from Mediterranean Natural and they come in at £1.49. Mmm, will we try one? Oh, that's a shame. Sorry, Roxy. You're not allowed one. If I can open it. Oh, <coughs> sorry. So that's the packet there. I always get carried away and I just rip right into it without showing you guys the packaging. This is the treat, so it's like a bone. A wee bone. And they're quite soft. And Not sure. I've just broke a wee bit off so she's not getting a full one. Right, you can have a bit of chicken. Sorry, but I don't want you eating anything like too soon and then you get an upset tummy. Okay, so Pixie is loving that. So I'm just set that to one side. So they are really, really good. And we've got two of them. So there is a fresh packet there. So we're probably not going to get through all of these treats, but what I'm going to do is little Misty, our cousin, loves fish. So she's going to get some of these as well um, to take away home. Okay, now the next thing we have is Gum Gum Chew Toys times two. And it says, how cute are these eco-friendly Two toys from Anko, available in six different shapes. Which one did you get? We love these 100% non-toxic rubber toys with a hemp strap. What's more, they look great. No toy is indestructible, so keep an eye on your super chewers. Roxy. 
this is something that you can have but if it breaks then it goes in the bin because I know what you're like with your chewing and I need a pair of scissors I'm so unprepared oh my goodness you guys sorry I'm so unprepared for this video okay so oops so we look as if we have the bone to get any of the plastics. Whoa, look at that. Wait a minute till we get the other one I've done first. I've never seen these before in my life. They look really good. Although as I said, no toys indestructible, so knowing my two, they probably, they probably will get their way through it at some point. Okay, there we go. That's all the wee tags off. Right, oh, look at these. Well, one, do you want? You want the bone? Go take it then. Go take it. Oh, do you not like it? Oh, go chew it. Or do you want this end? Go to that end then. Go and take it. Go take your phone. Go take your phone. You get it. <laughs> And these look like wee kind of fish flakes, like skins. This is going to be stinking, I think everybody knows. I do not do fish, but uh, my dogs love it, so as long as they love it, that's all that matters. Oh! Roxy, you can't have that, do you? You can smell it. But you can't taste it. So it's like wee, wee bits of fish. Here you go. Not so sure. It's really crunchy. Oh, she seems to like that. Is that nice? Mm hmm Pixie approved. So that looks really, really good. So we like them and they come in at where's the price? Two pounds. Two pounds each. And we've got two of them. So again, one will be going to Little Misty. The next thing we have in here is Incredi Bubbles. Now we've had these before. Um, we got this in a shop somewhere, I cannot remember, it was like when Pixie was a puppy about two and a half years ago and we've not had them since, I don't think Roxy's ever seen them so I'm really excited to actually try them. Look at these, 
And we've got two of these. So again, one's going to be going to Misty. But these are incredible bubbles, not your average bubble stuff. Thousands of bubbles that last for hours. Fun for dogs and cats, kids and even adults. And they are obviously dog safe. And they are peach flavoured. Oh my goodness me. Okay, so let's see. I need to move my box out the road for this. When I have some bubbles, this you can play with. Wow. Oh, I can smell the peach. Right, sit. 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 Good girl, okay. I need to go back. Sit. Okay, are we ready? in Roxy's nose. I'll need to do a separate video for this. This is just too funny. Do you want some more? You ready? separate video on these just because I think it would be quite good to, to see them play with. Roxy looks as if she's really interested in that. So these bubbles come in at, with a piece of paper? They come in at £3.29 each, <coughs> excuse me, and we've got two of them. So that is really good also. Excuse me, excuse me. And as you can see, Pixie's still got one in her ear and she's got wee bubble bits on her back. Silly. Does it taste good though? Mm hmm Tastes like peach? Okay, now the next thing we have in here... Where's my piece of paper? The next thing we have in here is Emma Please Treat Put Bag Holder. Which is this, and that is very cute. So this little bag is from the incredibly talented Emma, who is only 16 years old and makes amazing handmade dog beds and mini accessories to name a few. Okay, so this is a cute wee tartan bag and it's got a lovely wee clip on it and a nice wee dog and it's got her website here so I'm going to pop that in the link down below if you guys fancy taking a wee look. Let's see. So that's a bag there, sorry, I'm doing it again. That's a cute wee bag. Don't know if I would keep treats in it, but it would be quite handy to keep like a wee emergency stash of put bags. Oh, a 
and it came with a wee put bag. Fantastic. A wee free bag. Mm -hmm. And it obviously comes with a clip so that you can clip it on to like your dog's lead or your pocket or something like that or in your bag. So that is really, really handy. Thank you very much, Emma. So we'll pop that back in there just now. I'd be afraid to put treats in that in case I actually stump the bag out. Okay, now the next thing that we have, we've still got two things left in here, but there's nothing left on the information leaflet. It just says look out for your bonus items this month. So I'm guessing that these are, oh yes, well it would help, it says bonus gifts. So that would uh, be why. Let's get the box out of there. Okay, so these are pure salmon, 100% salmon that is grain free, award winning dog treat proudly made in Europe. This product is certified gluten free. Uh, no additives, no preservatives, nothing. It's just 100% salmon. Can you not bark and watch on the television, please? Do you want the salmon stick? These look really, really tasty. Again, Roxy, sorry. You can't have one of these. Mm. Oh. So this is the stick here. And they look quite hard. I don't think they're easy to break. Oh, so they just snap, which is really good. So they can like, oh, 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 that was close. Oh, dear goodness, that was close. They can snap into wee bits as well, which is really good. So would you like one? Like one? Come here. No, 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 no. You can't have one. Sorry. Hey, give me a paw. Give me a paw. Do you get up any other one? You going to twiddle? You going to stand? Come here. Speak. Come here. There you go. There you are. And you get your wee bit of chicken. Oh, crunchy, crunchy. Come here, Paul. Another one. Oh, good girl. And the other one. This one. No, this one. High five. Good girl. There you go. Okay, you guys. So that is our box from Pet Nature this month and we are happy with all the items in here. Um, oh, the dogs love fish and I love that the box is kind of fish orientated. Although some of the treats should have really have been pork, but because I chose my two not to have pork, then they obviously had to substitute that for something else, which was really good. Um, but we are happy with that box and we're happy to see what we get in the next month's box. Although it will be smaller, it'll be the same kind of items, just less of them which is really good so we are thankful for everything we got in our box this month i'll leave the link to pet nature box down below in the description box and give us a thumbs up if you like this video leave us a comment down below and as always please subscribe to our channel and we will see you guys later bye